I'm gonna make this a quick independent unboxing video since it probably won't be too relevant by the time I can actually put it in with other stuff. So this is a package from Lord Grimley's Manor. And about a year ago, I was getting a similar package from them as well. Mmm, that smells like Halloween. Alright, here we go. I've been seeing good things online. And... I mean, it's all smushed up. But I got myself the Halloween Ends Trick or Treat Studios mask. So, uh, yeah, this looks decent. So, I know some seem to have more of the, uh, mold on them than others. This one seems decently heavy, both on the one side that I knew was going to be on the burnt side, but, uh, I didn't realize it was on the other side as well. It's a lot around the bullet wound, and then, uh, kind of up in the hairline, and then around the ear. But I did see a lot of people were saying that theirs had stuff around the nose. I don't seem to have as much as that, and I think that's probably better. However, I will say that this, uh, the paint is not as good as some of the ones I've seen online look. Or maybe they're just, uh, I don't know, maybe they just lit it better. But it's not terrible. For a stock Tots mask, this is pretty solid. I like that they actually did the hairline right this time. Instead of, uh, you know, leaving it to rehaulers to fix that stupid hairline. So I'll try messing with the hair a little bit and uh, get this guy on display. And uh, you may have noticed the knife I was using opening this up, uh, I've taken, that's the real knife, but I have gone ahead and done some, based on what I can see in the screenshots, made my own ends knife. So this is based off what I believe they based the real knife off of. Con safe prop, made it look all rusty and nasty, and uh, I'm going to have these available. So, uh, you know. Shameless self-promotion in my own video, but uh, it's my own video. Why not? So throw it on the shelf real quick. We've got it next to my Stabbing Cabin Studios rehauled kills mask. Probably going to have Rob redo this one for me as well. And then if we go over a little bit, we've got the uh, Halloween Killer 93 rehauled H40 mask. And then my rehaul of the Officer Francis head. And then I've got kind of all the appropriate knives thrown around here. Actually, some doubles of a couple of them. So, uh, yeah, my little, uh, new trilogy shelf is pretty much there. Honestly, just have to get this rehauled and then, uh, come up with some knife stands. 